Hello, my name is Paul Taylor and I'm the Director of the Centre for Research and Evidence on Security Threats, or CREST. I'm talking to you from our second annual conference, which is a great opportunity to reflect on what CREST has accomplished and where it seeks to go. So CREST is funded by the UK Security and Intelligence Agencies to undertake and synthesise cutting-edge research that helps them understand, mitigate and counter security threats. At this two-year point, we've done this by bringing together over 100 researchers from across the social and behavioural science disciplines. Some of these researchers have a background of working on security threats, others don't. But we encourage and stimulate their engagement with practitioners so that the best researchers can address problems of real use. These researchers are now working on one of our six core programmes, or as one of our 18 commissioned projects, or as one of our 15 PhD students. As an ESRC centre, our findings and outputs are based on open source data, our publications are in open access journals, and the data is archived for others to access. While academic articles are bread and butter, we also communicate our research in other ways. We translate the research into how-to guides and toolkits tailored for the, those who tackle security threats. And we publish an overview of our key areas through our quarterly magazine, Crest Security Review, of which there's now been five issues. I'm excited and I'm proud about the variety and usefulness of the research we're undertaking in Crest. I'd love to hear how you're using the research, if you'd like to engage with us, or if you would like to know more about the work we do. You can do so in a number of ways. Take a look at our website, www.crestresearch.ac.uk, where you can also sign up for a newsletter and follow us on social media.